Stay tuned. Yeah. All right. So. <laughs> uh, what is most important to you in life? My family and God. My God is number one. And then my family. So that just kind of leads into your personal philosophy. Do you have a kind of a personal philosophy of life? <laughs> I actually do. Well, it's a quote that I heard by, I think it's Billy Graham. And it's, he said that we're not here to convict or judge anybody. We're just here on this earth to love other people. And so I try to implement, implement that into my daily life and just love. Awesome. Uh, what is your proudest moment up until this point of your... My ACT. When I got a 31 on my ACT. Yes. I was really proud of that because I worked really hard to get mm -hmm. that score. Yes, you did work hard. I was proud of you too. Uh, do you, are you a writer? Do you like to write? Not recreationally, but I am a, I'm a good writer. At least my English teacher says I am. Mm -hmm. But it's not something I enjoy doing outside of academics, mm -hmm. really. Uh, so what does it mean to study? I don't quite understand that question. What does it mean? Like, if you're going to study something, like, are you just going to read about it? Or, you, like, explain I usually, your study habits, I guess. What, what is your, what's work, what have you okay. figured out that's worked for you? I usually have to, I read the textbook if that's what's required of us, and if I don't understand it from reading the textbook, t textbook and taking notes from the textbook, I'll usually go onto YouTube and I'll find a video of somebody explaining it, and then that usually helps me a lot, because I'm more, I'm more of a visual learner, and like, I don't, yeah, I, I learn better if I see it like diagrams and pictures, if I can draw those, I learn a lot better. Mm -hmm. I've noticed you color coordinate your notes. Yes, I, I love to use different pens and highlighters, and I love to take notes. I love okay. pretty notes. Okay. And so why did you choose to ch study biology and psychology? I've always been good at science in school, and I've really enjoyed biology and the study of life. If they had an anatomy, major like a human body major I would have totally done that one because anatomy mm -hmm. and physiology is my favorite science class I've taken okay. but biology is a second clo a close second mm -hmm. and then psychology is I just I think behavior is really fascinating and the brain is really fascinating and how your environment just affects you and the way you act mm -hmm. just interests me a lot and I would love to learn more about that and I think it'll help me a lot as a doctor to know about people's behavior and why they do, do the things that they do. What are you good at that nobody knows or really thinks or recognizes? Maybe. I guess or nobody knows about. I guess I'm good at baking. Not a lot of people know that about me, but my family. But I enjoy cooking and baking. Yes. Yes, you are very good at that. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so, who are your heroes or role models? Jesus. How do you respond to stressful situations? Um. Like when your mom says, I'm going to interview you for YouTube. I laugh. Maybe. <laughs> just kind of laugh it off most of the time. Mm -hmm. I work pretty well under stress. Like in school, like if I'm pretty good, like if I procrastinate a little bit, which you shouldn't obviously procrastinate, but if I do, I still am able to produce pretty good work even under stress. Okay, thank you. What you doing? Power washing. All right. Playing in the car. We already wiped down the inside, vacuumed it. I showed you where the spare tire is. So that's important. Doing good today. So you carried some drawers outside? Uh-huh. 
but and we have cleaned out the car this morning after doing that we've got to put our rug in here and some drawers we're going to attempt to get everything that she has in our two Subarus we'll see how that goes I think we can do it see what Already? Already. Awesome. Got your car full. Oh, video car. <laughs> car packed full. Yep. And we are on our way to Magnolia. So we left and now we're coming back. What did we forget? Forgot my headphones sunglasses all right <laughs> well we uh we only got about 12 minutes down the road and realized we forgot those items so we're back to get them So this is our room. We got our dressers in there. My desk. Under the bed storage. Chair. That's my bed. My wall stuff. Purge and microwave. Roommate side. Yep. That's about it. That's a wrap on college move-in. We got our girl settled in and she is happy and we are too. We appreciate your care and concern and interest in um, following what the family's got going on. So we appreciate it. Thank you. Love you. Take care. God bless.